Hi, this is Open Water Mike. I'm um, doing some flies, making some coconut flies, and here's some new material I've gotten. Let's get a little close up. It's from the Purple Tackle Fly Supply Company. Uh, great material. I'm going to show you how e fast, easy way of doing a coconut fly. And I've just got a few small pieces here. And that's all we need to make our coconut. You can mix up any color you want. If you're not familiar with that company, go onto their website, check out all the material they got. I like to try to use a number four or a number six treble hook. And I got right here is a quarter inch tube that I cut down about a quarter inch long. And I'll show you how we try to do all this. I take my pieces and I put them on top of one another just like this. And we're going to take and fold them up so we can get them through the eye of the hook. And we'll try to do that now. Alright, we just keep folding it over until it gets kind of pretty small. And we'll feed this right through the eye of the hook. Alright, now we did feed it through the eye of the hook. That's what the end looks like, feeding it through. And down here at this one end, we want to keep in mind at this end here, try to imagine it, if it was folded down here, that the that end would come right right in through here pretty close to it. can be a little bit long because you're going to have to trim it anyhow. And we'll take that quarter inch hose and we'll put it on the top and we'll do that next. Alright, there's that quarter inch tube. And I'm fitting it right on top of the eye. going to cover it down and shove the tube just past the eye. And now that we got quite a bit of material here you just have to make sure you get a good pretty good firm grip on the hook without stabbing yourself and then uh, we'll do the trimming here as soon as we get that taken care of okay now we got that tube shoved down just below the eye and the excess that we have right here we're gonna bring it down and trim this back half off Okay, we trimmed that one part off, and this is what we end up with, but I like it just a little bit shorter. So I'll show you how we just kind of fold those up and trim it just a little bit more. Alright, so we just kind of twist them up a little bit. You can see where the hook's at, and right there at my fingertips. So we're going to trim off at least about a quarter of an inch of the tail end of it off. So we'll do that now. Okay, we've done all of our trimming and stuff, and this is one of my hot colored ones that I do fairly well on, and that's a coconut fly. I hope you try this out, and I hope it works good for you. Thanks for watching.